welcome back from the break. Many of us have wondered what the right way is to drink wine. It can get pretty complicated for a beginner to pair the right wines with a meal or even just to simply choose a drink for the hot weather. Well, we sat down with wine experts to see how they could get help. This representative came down from Wente Vineyard in California to give lectures to food and beverage industry managers on the proper way to serve and pair wines. The purpose for Aruba this time was to kind of educate the, the island on Chardonnay, to kind of show people that California is um, a Chardonnay uh, grape varietal, and it's one of the most popular varietals in California, and we're producing about uh, 100,000 acres of land that's dedicated just to the Chardonnay grape. Being on the island that has warm climate 365 days a year, is there a specific brand or type of wine that would be more refreshing? I mean, there's many, many wines that you can drink in hot climates like this. I mean, you can drink a, a beautiful white wine, a beautiful wet, or red wine. Just we have to make sure the temperature of the wine is always nice and cool and very fresh. Um, today, we're, we focus on Chardonnay. Um, Any time this summer, as long as the temperature is nice, um, around 40 degrees, you can drink a nice Chardonnay sitting on the beach or sitting at a restaurant. Um, Wente also produces a Sauvignon Blanc. It's a nice grape varietal for fresh and crispiness and it's great for the summertime. The owner of Arion Wine Company explains that the best way for a beginner to get into drinking wine is to explore a lot and probably to start with a good appetizer. Yeah, that's not so easy. As Jason mentioned too, I think getting started uh, drinking wine is exploring a lot. And sometimes, you know, when you browse the shelves of the supermarket or just the wine list at a restaurant, um, um, and you order something that's not right away what you had in mind, then, uh, then, then make sure you, you have some food with it. So uh, wine is changing the moment you, you have a little bite with it. Um, there's a lot of Dutch cheese on the island. I think that's a great, great match with uh, especially red wines, but sometimes with, uh, with white wines as well. So I think stepping into the world of wines is, is exploring a lot.